So, what's the big news? What do you know about the Capitol building? Um, it's big, it's blue, everyone thinks it's an eyesore, though I personally think it looks kinda cool. The ignorance of the general public never ceases to amaze me. Hey! Aside from being an eyesore, which it is, the building also acts as an antenna directing all drone activity in the city. So what, did you find the building's schematics? Are we gonna toss a bomb down the thermal exhaust port and blow it up? This isn't a movie, Sam. Besides, we've tried that. The whole building is shielded from both physical and cyber attacks, and the drones prevent us from getting close enough to break through the shielding in person. I'm guessing this is the part where it gets juicy. The drone control network is offline for maintenance. The building is defenseless. Wait, if the drone network is down, how come they're still active? Good question. These three points are temporary control stations, keeping the drones in action till maintenance is complete. If we could take them out, there'd be nothing to stop an assault on the Capitol building. That's where I come in. Hey, Charlie! As you know, I got something special cooked up for this one. We just need you to knock out those control stations. If we can pull this off, it might finally turn the fight in our favor. Oh, good. No pressure then. Sure thing. Now it's raining. <laughs> what do we do once the stations are knocked out? Charlie and I will drive her van into the building and jack into their systems manually. From there, we can delete them or take control of the drones ourselves. Ooh, we're not about to become villains, are we? Ezra Corp does have a nice ring to it. Why am I facing like that way? I mean, this building is very good for traveling. I'm at the station, but it's shielded. How do I get through? Kinda got my hands full right now. Ow, easy, Charlie. Can you figure it out? Um... I don't think I should have done that. Okay. This course of action is ill-advised. You again! Emerson planted fake intel for you to find. Your friends are walking into a trap. What? Are you sure? Ezra, we sure about this plan? What? No, Charlie, left of the lights. Left! Sorry, what did you say? What if the intel is bad? We could be walking into a trap. I know Astra's protocols better than they do. The intel is real. Yeah, but what if you got it wrong? Sam, Charlie and I are en route to the capital. You need to knock out those towers now. Two down, one left. Your friends are committed to this plan, but you can still save yourself. And leave them? Self-preservation is the rational choice. Rational or not, you don't just abandon people, no matter how bad it gets. Or maybe you do. Mm, I don't know. Sam, we're almost there! Take out the last tower! The last tower is down, you're clear. We're approaching the Capitol building. It shouldn't take us too long to break their defense. Ezra? Ezra! It is too late for them. Save yourself. Ezra, if you can hear me, hold tight, I'm coming! This one. Crawler, incoming. If it reaches us, we're cooked. Hello. Wow. 
what is coming? <laughs> Okay, come down. escaping oh, it's too close okay Charlie try it now hell yeah let's roll <laughs> Hold on. I think we're in the clear. What the hell? Uh, Up there. Oh, Whoa. Shit. My God. Huh. What do we do? I, I, I don't. You two get out of here. I'll handle that thing. Sam, that thing is shielded. You can't Whoa. kill it. Who said anything about killing it? I'm trying to buy you time. Now move. Sam, it's working. Keep distracting it. Damn. Uh-uh. I was gonna hang around with this giant killer robot all day, but if you think I should go... Right, right. I'll talk to you back at the safe house. Assuming I make it back in one piece. Okay. Screw that. Pretty big thing. I'm assuming it's uh, immortal for now. I like how the traveling is so fast here. <laughs> if you just get used to the mechanics. What the hell happened back there? You were right. It was a trap. Astra knew we were coming. If you hadn't been there to distract that monster. Distract it was about all I could do. My guns were useless against its shields. How are we gonna beat that thing? I have an idea. You see the headset apparatus in the corner? You mean the cyberpunk gimp mask I've been pretending not to notice? It's called a neural bridge. We can use it to find schematics for that thing. Put it on. Okay, but for the record, my safe word is pineapple. <laughs> <sighs> Wait. I know this place. This is... The city? Not quite. This is actually just a visual representation of information. I could make it look like anything, really, but the city seemed like a natural choice. 
<gasps> what the hell is that? Sam, you have to keep moving in here. Head for that beacon. I'll explain as we go. Now get to another beacon before the timer runs out. I'm guessing bad things will happen if I don't. Best not to find out. So what am I doing, exactly? Right now, you're hacking into the Astra R&D network. By swinging through glowing lights? The neural bridge translates physical input into computer code, and vice versa. Your actions are guiding the hacking program as it breaks into the Astra network. Oh, that makes sense. Really? Not even a little bit. Shit, it's far. be a dumb question, but if the program is this advanced, do I really need to be here? Yes. This software is good, but it can't match the complexity of the human brain. By using your own neural pathways as a framework, the program becomes extremely adaptable and robust. So it's just using me like a parasite? No, your actions also guide the program and add crucial unpredictability. It's more of a symbiotic relationship, like tarantulas and frogs. Tarantulas and... You know what? I don't want to know. Are you sure? It's quite fascinating. I'd be more than happy to explain it in detail. I bet you would. Hard pass. I feel like sometimes uh, if I turn too much, I can't like return to my original spot. I think it's something to do with settings. Got it. That's it. I'm pulling you out. How do you feel? Using the neural bridge for the first time can leave people a little disoriented. Ezra, listen to me. I've been to that Sorry to interrupt, but if you two are finished playing Pitfall, we still have a 200 ton item on our to-do list. But that thing patrolling our streets, no one can move. Yet I'm running dangerously low on snacks. Let's analyze the data you found. Computer, begin tactical analysis. I beg your pardon? <laughs> Nothing, what did we find? Right. Well, the good news is we can fight this thing. The unit on top is the shield generator. Destroy it, and the shield is gone. And the bad news? Even without a shield, this thing will be tough. But it does have its weak points. Lex? Destroying these targeting cameras will make the laser much less accurate while taking out the knee servos should severely inhibit its movement speed. Eyes and knees, just like Mom taught me. <laughs> and if you can get behind it, destroying these power generators will inflict massive damage. Then it's... dead, right? Almost. Cause enough damage and it will become vulnerable. All you have to do then is get on top of it, rip off this hatch, and blow up the core. Oh, is that all? Sam, you got this. You'd better hope so, because if I fail, I'm coming back to haunt you. <laughs> I'll set a waypoint. No need. You can hear that thing from miles away. Just keep moving, avoid the laser, and I'll coach you through the rest. We'll be fine. And attack here from the top. There, on the front. 
targeting cameras. It's pretty easy from the top though, so... Oh my god. to me you piece of shit that's president piece of shit please show some Whoa. respect this is just the beginning you hear me i'm coming for you oh i'm counting on it was that emerson damn you must have really pissed him off i swear to god when i find that son of a bitch one battle at a time sam despite what he said you've struck a major blow to astra today and i know just how to capitalize on it we'll have to wait till dark though let me know when you're ready. It was a little bit easy, but maybe I am a pro. Who knows? 